when I was in uh, high school, worked at a restaurant as a hostess uh, for a short period of time. Um, and then I went into the army and did my time there. I had found myself working for a dentist while going to school and having children and was bored to tears. And um, I really wanted to try something new and I ended up being a server at a new restaurant opening for an Olive Garden in McHenry. As a veteran, um, it has always been, um, it's difficult because a lot of people don't understand what we learned in the military and how it applies to the civilian world. Uh, to the people that have never served, they don't understand when they look at your resume. I was impressed, it was the first time in an interview that someone had asked me how, um, how that stuff translated because they didn't always understand everything on there. There's um, been managers in other regions um, that, you know, are still serving in the reserves or the Air Guard and then they get deployed and they go away and do their thing and they come back and there's a home for them still and they, they do, they pick up like, like they never left. I've hired a lot of veterans through the years and um, work side by side with them and some of them having been through combat and been through really, really horrible uh, situations that were physically and mentally healing and that we were able to give them a job when they thought they weren't hireable anywhere um, and to work with them and work around the disabilities that they were left with after serving their country. That's a pretty phenomenal company to work for. Thank you.